Good morning, everyone, or good afternoon, wherever you are. Um, I think it's, it's afternoon here, but um, Syncretic Gardener here. And I'm going to talk about um, my grow bags, as I promised. So this is my grow bag. I'm going to turn it so that you can see the aspects of it. Um, and it's a, it's a three-gallon bag. So it took me, I'd say, about um, 20 quarts, 22, 20 to 22 quarts to get it around, like fully full. Because it, you know, it thickens out. You know, it's it's made of felt, um, and it's round. Um, the dimensions of it are like, it's like a, the length, or the the height of it is like 11.9 inches. Maybe that's like 30 centimeters for those that are dealing in centimeters. And um, the, you know, the width is is round around a 7.9. It's 20 centimeters. I think the handles are just like. 7.7 7 and a half inches long those up there so um, I already put some of the seedlings in of the peppers um, I'm gonna do this for you so that you can see how I do it um, and how you're how I've been learning that you do it so I've got a couple of seedling um, jalapeno peppers here they got some true leaves on them I'm gonna take one of them here right and gently remove it Right, so I already pre-moistened this bag um, carefully um, because it was easier to manipulate things. And I was really worried about damaging, you know, the roots there so delicate uh, when I first started doing it. But most of them seem to be doing quite well. Now, eventually it's going to go out there in that wonderful sunshine, but it's still too cool where I'm at. I'm, I'm in the northern part of 7B, so it's still too cool for things like this to go outside. But I got it in a very sunny place so that I can make that transfer pretty easily. So here, um, you can see, I usually, let me lay this down here for a second. I, I took like a chopstick that I had and kind of made a burring hole in there. Because what's going to happen is the roots are going to fan out within the bag and the inside of the bag, right? And then they can hang down. So I'll probably, I'm going to be doing some um, determinate tomatoes that bush out and only grow a certain size. I'm going to do my tiny Tim tomatoes in the other bags. I have two other bags right now. All right, so now I'm gently um, pushing in. Now, I had to pull this felt out to widen it. Um, and you can also, I guess, cut it if you wish to. And I can still do that to some. Because I didn't feel it was giving a lot of room. Because, see, you can see there's a hole in there. Let me put that down again. There's a hole in there. That's where the growing is. See that? That's where it is. So I basically pulled the felt out. Because, you know, it closes the, over it. But not too tightly. But some, I read some reviews on it. You know, it's a, just a $15 bag. Um that they said, said that the hole was too small, so people just widened it. Um, but here we go, I'm gonna put it in there. And I already made the, the hole in there, and I gently tuck it in, and I can, you know, I can kind of manipulate the soil around it so that it's there, right? And it kind of sits in that, and as the soil moves around in the grow bag, um, it settles into the roots, and the roots just grow within the bag right so there's a good amount of it and then you get this effect all around right you get the roots growing um, I do turn this because it's in a window right now like I said it's still it's still a little cool for it for the for the different seedlings they have other places seedlings um, that that I can put in um, it's an extra space here um, so what happens with the seedlings is, is the, they root inside the bag and then they can hang down. So it's good for things like um, maybe strawberries, um, tomatoes, um, these peppers that dangle, anything that dangles like this. Some people were showing in the description they've used potatoes in them. But, you know, I have my potatoes outside in my grow bag um, that sit on the ground. So eventually they're going to go out there and I'm still deciding on like how I'm going to do that. How I'm going to make the hooks for them and then, you know, put them out there. And then, you know, I have all this wonderful sunny space. This is the southwest, south, southwest area out here facing window. So it's getting lots of beautiful sunlight. Um, so, yeah, so that's my update on my grow bag. Um, I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, you know, I'm here. I'm, I'm, I'm a novice at this. And if you have any tips, I'm, I'm happy to hear those too. But, you know, that's what we have so far. And um, that's how it's going. All right. Syncretic Gardener saying have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.